All right, you guys, welcome back. We got a crazy story here, right? It says, 73-year-old grandma killed by teen carjackers, arm ripped off as she was dragged down the street. It's, this is New Orleans, you all right? Four teenagers face murder charges in connection with a carjacking that left a 73-year-old woman dying on New Orleans Street. Her arm severed after she was dragged a block by her own car while neighbors looked on helplessly, officially said Tuesday. A law enforcement source identified the accused killers as 17-year-old John Honoro and three 15-year-old girls, uh, Brynja, Brynja, whatever your name is, Baker, Marquel Curtis, and Lenira. Boy, these people got some fool-up name, you hear? Theophile, whatever your damn name is. The teens are booked with second-degree murder. NOPD uh, Superintendent Sean Ferguson said at a news conference at police headquarters, two were turned in by their parents, all faced second-degree murder charges, and Ferguson said he will recommend that they be charged as adults. The story hits me this this story hits me extra hard because this is the city I grew up in. Uh, it's very sad to see it turning into a such horrible place. This woman could have been my grandmother. She lost her life in the most horrifying way. These kids would wouldn't even open the door to let the woman out when her arm was stuck uh, as they drove off. Ooh, this is what one person uh, said uh, that felt some kind of way. Okay, so. <sighs> this is crazy. This is a crazy situation. I mean, I don't understand how you. How, well, I, I, I'm assuming when I hear stuff like this, uh, the, the, the these youngins involved, uh, 17 and 15 year old, they ain't no way you raised with love, or you ain't no way you felt loved or something. Like I don't see how you got it in you. To, it's bad enough that you rob. You, you know, you feel like at seventeen and fifteen, you robbing a car. Cause what is you doing? Like where where you where you planning to go? That, like, I mean, honestly, fifteen and seventeen, where are you planning to go? <laughs> Silly. Obviously, your brain is not even fully developed. But I'm not laughing. I'm laughing because of the stupidity. Like where where do you think you're going? I mean, even at seventeen, y'all, I had enough sense not to. I, I wouldn't even have the guts to get in to try to rob someone else's car, let alone seeing a person trying to like basically, uh, I guess, trying to stop them and, and say, hey, no, don't get in my car or whatever. But they just I don't get I don't get it. And you see her arm is stuck. And yet y'all still got like this is crazy. Y'all this this these are some wild young teens. With some with a with a crazy mindset, but I'm sorry, I I I don't feel bad at all that they're being ch charged as adults. I get that their brain is not fully developed, but hey, at 17, you know better. Even at 15, you know you know not to to, to take someone's car. We ain't talk I mean, whatever happened to a piece of candy? I mean, stealing ain't right, period. But dang, whatever happened to taking a piece of candy or something? They try to take a whole dang on car. Well, cause what, cause where you going? I'm trying to figure like where is you, where are you going, sir, ma'am? Where are you going? How long you like? How long did you plan to keep the car? How long you thought you was gonna keep the car? What did y'all stupid tail minds thought was go? And it's bad enough like you got this older woman arm stuck in, and you didn't even think to stop to. It's sad and unfortunate. So rest in peace to this woman and. Uh, prayers to the family that gotta wake up to this mess and or you know get the call from the police or they come to their door and let them know hey this is what happened to your grandma this is unfortunate y'all we sure do better like do better i just uh yeah comment in the comment section and tell me what you think about this crazy tale story